What is up you guys? It's your girl Alexa takes a look and today we are back and today we're back with more Mission Souls and this is a request that comes from Coffee and I'm actually super excited because it is a double feature. We have got a Paramour double feature and we are taking a look at That's What You Get and also Crush Crush Crush. Um, now, a little background between me and Paramore. Um, I never super got into Paramore back in the day. Um, there are a couple of songs that I do know, obviously, like the more famous ones like That's What You Get and a couple of other ones whose names uh, I don't really know. But Crush, 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 I don't think I've ever heard. I don't think. And so this will be a new experience for me. So thank you so much, Superfly Lee from Coffee for this request if you'd also like to make a request and get your request bumped up through a donation you can do so on patreon or coffee links are down below or in my bio also we are still on the road to 10k we're getting there a lot faster than i thought we would um so if you haven't subscribed please consider doing so we are just going to jump right into this paramore double feature let's get into it all right, so we have the video bleh, video pulled up here. So this is the song that I have heard before. So I'm very excited to see what Mission Souls does to it. And I'm very curious for the next video how I'm going to feel about it since I haven't heard the song before. So to me, the first time hearing that song is going to be through Mission Souls. So I'm very excited for that. So let's just go ahead and get right into this. <laughs> I love it. His bucket hat and glasses. No, sir. Well, I don't want to be the blame. Not anymore. It's your turn to take a seat with satellite. The final score. And why do we lie to her? So far, she can't decide. You have made it harder just to go on. And why? I I feel like I say this every time, but her voice fits this. Okay. We got a little background vocal there. Get it. I love how they're putting the little clips of the original. Drummer is just such a vibe. <laughs> singing together.
is so cute. <laughs> okay, I'm going to talk about it a little bit before we get into this next one. It was super cute to see them. I feel like they really enjoyed that song in particular. I noticed their little smiles and like the little part where it was like, hey, like it was super cute. They felt like, I don't know, it just felt like they particularly enjoyed that song. Um, little Drummer Boy in his in his bucket hat and his glasses is such a vibe. The way that he's like hitting the drum, it just seems so nonchalant. And I know it's not nonchalant. Like I know it's very deliberate and it took talent and practice, but he just makes it look so easy and so cool. But let's go ahead and get into this next one. Have I heard this song? I don't know. Okay, we get another trio singing. Definitely haven't heard this song. Energy. Guitar girly. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> so cute. Okay. That was interesting because I haven't heard that song before, so I don't really have anything to compare it to. Um in my mind, that could have been an original song. And what I wanted to say was, the moment this family starts putting out original music, it's like over for everyone. <laughs> like, I mean, granted, they do so well with their covers because I feel like they do such a good job of both staying true to the original in the ways that need to be stayed true, if that makes sense. But they still put their own, like, kind of a uh, twist to it their own flair their own it's very subtle but it's there you know their own sound to it and so i feel like they do such a good job with covers but if they ever start putting out originals like i don't know i don't know what are we gonna do they're gonna just become like this superhuman family 
that kicks butt and takes names like I don't know <laughs> but uh, yeah that was super good the first song they did really well there was like a moment where uh, the lead singer girly my girly which I'm gonna look up her name real quick so I don't keep calling her girly Stacy Stacy you can tell that there was like a little bit of a hiccup but she does so well not letting it get to her and just breezing right through it and I mean come on like nobody's perfect so like they're gonna be hiccups I can't even do nearly anything that she's doing so I'm not even one to really talk but um but it just shows that they are human <laughs> which is nice for me to know uh because sometimes they seem non-human like I said I don't know how they are like memorizing and mastering this music so quickly and putting out as much music as they are that's beyond me um but yeah, I literally, I can't wait if they do end up doing their own music. It's going to be great. And it's so interesting for me. I really liked doing this double feature where there's one song that I know from this, from Paramore. And then there was one song that I didn't know because like making the comparisons is very interesting. Like I can tell it's a Paramore song because Paramore has this very distinctive style. But at the same time, it's so unfamiliar to me, so it just seems natural that it's Mission Souls playing it. I don't know. Anyways, that's it for, for now. It is the holidays here. I don't know if it's the holidays where you are, but if it is, happy holidays. If not, I hope you have a happy weekend. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share whatever the cool YouTubers say. It's your girl Alexa takes a look, and I am bouncing out. Bye!